Hey folks out there. So this is uh, Georgia Tech's online master's in artificial intelligence. And we're going to talk about uh, the details of this program, how much it's going to cost, what is admission requirements, and dive a little bit into the what are the going to study there in terms of subjects there. All right. So Georgia Institute of Technology. Uh, it's ranked 38th nationally, located in Atlanta, Georgia. It's a public research university with a graduation rate of 90%, which is very impressive, and acceptance rate of around 36, 37% there, which makes it a little bit of not so easy to get into there. Diving into the master's program, into the computer science side, there are five options in there. Those are computational perception and robotics, computing system, human computer interaction, interactive intelligence, and machine learning. And for today's uh, video, we are now talk about interactive intelligence and machine learning only. All right, so Georgia Tech has two programs, as I said there, in interactive intelligence and machine learning. Those have something slight in common there, but depends on what you want to study, you need to pick one of these programs. Both these programs have uh, credit hours of 30 requirements, which means 10 classes. The specializations, the, sorry for that, the specializations will cover, uh, will take around 15 to 18 hours there and 12 to 15 uh, uh, credit hours, we say, right? Not, not the hours of study. And electives is going to take 12 to 15 hours. If you are doing it with a part time, it can take up to 36 months because it's a big commitment there. So if you're planning to if you're thinking about doing it in under 18 months, that might be really, really tough, right? So that wouldn't be possible there, to be honest. All right. So uh, both these programs do not have any courses on generative AI, right? So that's a kind of a little bit bummer for those who want to go a little bit more into generative AI. But unfortunately, so far, we haven't seen any university offering courses in generative AI. All right, so diving back into the machine learning course, what exactly do you gonna learn there? So the core courses includes computationality, algorithms and complexity, introduction to graduate algorithms, computational complexity theory, design and analysis of algorithms. The optionals are machine learning, computational data analyst, learning, mining and computation. And optionals are not just like you take a list of optionals with each core courses there is a list of optionals so you can pick some of them there so pick your choice when you're doing the course there all right I talk about admission requirements so you need to probably have an undergraduate degree in computer science related field gpa of 3.0 or higher and probably that might be a little bit flexible depending on your work x and your resume and your uh, recommendations there the good thing is gre scores are not required which makes it much easier for you to apply to these programs there. It is recommended that you have a basic knowledge of Python because that uh, is a uh, part of all the courses in AI anywhere you go. And uh, with the classes there, you might be struggling if you don't know the basics there. All right, let's come to the, uh, the most interesting part, the tuition. The tuition per credit hour is $180 there. And uh, that translates to around 30 times 80, around $5,400, $5,500 there. And with the technology and semester fees, you would not be paying more than $7,000 for this master's program, which makes it uh, such a killer deal there. Because when compared to other universities, they have program ranging from $10,000 to $40,000 there. And with Georgia Institute's technologies, the reputation and brand, I'm pretty sure you would be loving this course there. But remember, this is an online master's program, right? So just going back to talk about what you gonna do here, is it gonna be live classes? No, these are pre-recorded lectures. You have to do assignments that will be graded. And there is a tiered structure of human support for students to interact with their professors and teaching assistants, typically involving electronic email discussion boards and virtual office hours. Hope that makes sense. So basically no live interaction, but you will always have some teaching assistants and professors on emails and discussion boards there. 
All right, coming back to this. Uh, maybe this is a little bit more going to the details there into the programs, uh, but uh, you have already talked about this one. So jumping on to the last slide there and summarization. So masters in AI, Intel, artificial intelligence is cost $7,000 in Georgia Tech, which takes around three years to complete. This is an online masters, but the degree you will get will have a masters in artificial intelligence written over it, right? Hope this helps. If you want to explore some more AI programs online or on campus, visit collegehippo.com and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and leave comments down there. Happy to help. Thank you.